Hey, this is Lisa from FitLab, and this is Kristen with Treadmill Review Guru, and welcome to our in-depth review of Peloton Bike Plus versus Nordic Track S22i Studio Cycle. You will find the links to the products in the description, and you can use the links to check user reviews and the latest prices. Make sure to watch until the end of the video to know my final verdict on which bike is better. The main difference between the two bikes is the automatic resistance settings. The Peloton Bike Plus came with an automatic resistance mode. Still, the setting is programmed to follow the instructor's directions, meaning we could only use the resistance setting that the class instructor gave. On the Nordic Track S22i, however, we could easily change between resistance settings, even when we were not in a live session with an instructor. The Nordic Track S22i made a better bike than the Peloton Bike Plus because it has customizable resistance. Screen We enjoyed using the screen on the Peloton Bike Plus, which measured 24 inches and supported FHD and touch function. We could also rotate the screen 360 degrees, which was very convenient. In comparison, the Nordic Track S22i Studio Cycle presented a slightly smaller 22 inch screen. But it has loads of clarity thanks to its FHD setting. We liked that we could rotate the screen as it made following classes and trails from different angles easier. The Peloton Bike Plus came with a larger screen than the Nordic Track S22i Studio Cycle, making it a better bike in this category. Sound quality One of the things we liked best about the Peloton Bike Plus is that it came with four speakers, two at the front and two at the back. The speakers were of good quality, which gave us a better sound experience as we worked out. With its two front-mounted speakers, the Nordic Track S22i Studio Cycle provided commendable sound as we listened to music. We, however, found them less impressive. The Peloton Bike Plus made the better studio bike because it delivered high-quality surround sound. User Interface The UI on the Peloton Bike Plus was excellent, and we found it easy to navigate the bike and use different features and settings without much trouble. We found the interface very fast and responsive. The Nordic Track S22i Studio Cycle, on the other hand, presented a slower interface but we did not find it overly difficult to use. It just did not feel as fast or responsive as we'd hoped. Because of its speed and ease of use, the Peloton Bike's UI made for a better interaction than the Nordic Track S22i Studio Cycles. How do the two bikes compare in terms of specifications? Dimensions The Peloton Bike Plus wins because we found it slightly smaller. Weight the Peloton Bike Plus wins because we found it slightly lighter. Digital Resistance Levels The Peloton Bike Plus wins because we liked that it had many more resistance levels. Screen Size We preferred the Peloton Bike Plus's screen because it was larger. Fan We liked that the Nordic Track S22i came with a fan. Max User Weight the Nordic Track won because we liked that it could handle more weight. From the table, it's clear that the Peloton Bike Plus is a lighter machine than the Nordic Track S22i Studio Cycle. We also noticed its maximum user weight of 297 pounds, while the Nordic Track S22i has a max user weight of 350 pounds, which gave the Nordic Track an upper hand. Similarities between the Peloton Bike Plus and the Nordic Track S22i Studio Cycle. When using the bikes, we found that both came with a wide range of live classes. We could connect and interact with many people on the bikes, and they both came with leaderboards that showed our progress. Things you should know before purchasing the Peloton Bike Plus. When we tested this bike, we discovered it was incompatible with Swift, so we could not ride in a virtual scenery with an instructor. We had to do this independently, but we downloaded a few audio classes and listened to them on the phone as we worked out in different scenarios. We liked that the handles were very comfortable and sturdy, even in intense cycling. What we liked Numerous studio classes Strong and sleek build Large interactive screen Superior sound 
What we didn't like. Very expensive. Things you should know before purchasing the Nordic Track S22i Studio Cycle. We found that having this bike assembled by a professional would cost us more, so we decided to do it ourselves. It was a bit challenging, but the user manual offered us a clear guide even though it took us a long time to finish the assembly. On the flip side, we liked that this bike was quiet even when we cycled very fast. What we liked Great incline and decline settings. It comes with an inbuilt fan. Very strong and sturdy. Affordable. What we didn't like. The sound quality could be better. Verdict. So which is better? Peloton Bike Plus or Nordic Track S22i Studio Cycle? Even though it is more expensive, the Peloton Bike Plus makes a better studio bike than the Nordic Track S22i. We found it more interactive and enjoyed the outdoor scenery a lot as we worked out. The Nordic is also a worthy competitor due to its durability and great price. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel. Also, let us know what you would like us to compare next. Thanks for watching.